Welcome back. For those who suffer from mental health issues, when medication doesn't work, it can feel like the end of the road. But a non-invasive therapy that's existed for decades is now becoming more popular here in South Florida and around the world. It's called transcranial magnetic stimulation therapy, or TMS. CBS Four's Terry Hornston explains what it is and how it works. You may have seen the ads on TV or online recently for TMS therapy. It's not new. It's been around since 1985, but now more than ever, patients are using it when other forms of treatment just aren't working. We went to a local mental health clinic and talked to some patients who say it's changed their lives. I got divorced. I have two daughters. <laughs> My life tank. It's been a long road for Andy Burton. I had come down to Florida really to end my life. A road full of depression, anxiety, and intrusive thoughts. But in recent months, those thoughts have quieted to almost a whisper after he found Gia Miami. That clutter in my head finally turned off. I mean, that's like since I was a kid. It's a very, very precise system. Dr. Antonello Bonci runs the mental health clinic, where they provide traditional therapies we've all heard about. Medication, talk therapy, but they're known for transcranial magnetic stimulation therapy, or TMS. It was shown basically that patients with depression had lower activity in certain brain regions, such as the frontal region. The machine was designed to reactivate this brain region that was less active than normal. TMS is a non-invasive procedure using magnetic fields to stimulate nerve cells in the brain involved in mood. It's believed the process activates areas of the brain with decreased activity and depression. Traditionally used as a last resort, it has helped people around the world. The data showing a 70% success rate in lessening symptoms of depression and anxiety. And that's not all. It was chaotic, um, it was traumatic, it was stressful. Uh, it was everything you don't expect your life to be. Stephen Three, a former college football player, says his trouble started when he suffered injuries on the field. I was a football player. Uh, I had to retire due to concussions. Uh, there was a lot of self-medication. Stephen says that's when his years-long troubles with drugs and alcohol began. I was really at the end of my road. Nothing felt manageable. You know, I felt out of control. He says it took just a few TMS sessions before he felt a significant change and his need to reach for drugs and alcohol was gone. It feels a little too good to be true. And I think people who are suffering in the way that I know I was, um, they have a hard time coming to believe in, in something like that. The process takes about 20 minutes per session. Most patients complete about 36. It doesn't hurt uh, at all. Actually, you get like super relaxed. The patients do say it isn't TMS alone. All of them also are in talk therapy, some also on medication, and they all say they take steps every day to improve their lives. But without TMS, many wonder where they would be today. Like before, I was like lost. And when I start coming here and having the TMS sessions, I start like discovering myself again. I remind myself of where I was, but I don't like to imagine where I would be. Saved my life, literally. Just no question in my mind. TMS is not cheap, but some insurance companies do cover it. If yours doesn't, TMS can cost between ten and twelve thousand dollars to complete the thirty-six sessions recommended, with the possibility of a few more needed for maintenance. Dr. Bonchi tells me he is hoping in the next few years more companies begin to see the value and the long-term benefits. He says if a patient is interested, it is still worth reaching out to your insurance company to ask. In the studio, Terry Hornstein, CBS4 News tonight.